Ah uh, yes, RMS Britannic, a ship that absolutely nobody else remembers, except for maritime hi historians out there. Why does a lot of people not know about this ship, eh, or why do they not like it? Well, it's probably because of this type of video. Seriously, stop adding Sleeping Sun in every single Britannic Aside from a little bit of memes from the start, let's talk about Britannic's awful and boring career. And now that it's just a meme on the maritime history people out there. You know, I don't know what's the word of it, but I'm gonna tell you a little bit about it. Also, I will be taking this information from the Titanic or Britannic Wikipedia, so no need to, you know, copy strike me or anything. HMHS, not HMS Britannic, but HMHS Britannic was the third vessel of the White Star Line's Olympic class of steamships and the second White Star ship to bear the name Britannic. She was the fleet mate of both Aramis Olympic and Aramis Britannic and was intended to enter service as a transatlantic passenger liner. Keep, keep note on that on your head. Britannic was launched just before the start of the First World War. She was designed to be the safest of the three ships with design changes action during the construction due to lessons learned from the sinking of Titanic. She was laid up at her builders Harlan and Wolf in Belfast for many months before being re requisitioned as a hospital ship in 1915 and 1916. She served between the United Kingdom and Darnellis. Sorry if I mispronounced that. Britannic had a layout very similar to her sister ships. However, following the loss of Titanic and the subsequent inquiries, several design changes were made to the remaining Olympic class liners. With Britannic, these changes made before launch included increasing the ship's beam to 94 feet 29m to allow for a double haul along the engine and boiler rooms and raising six out of the 15 water tight bulkheads up to b deck now let's fast forward to 1916 or november 17 1916 or so at 8 12 on 21th of November 1916, a loud explosion shook the ship. The cause, whether it was a torpedo from an enemy submarine or a mine, was not apparent. It would later be revealed that mines were planted on the Kia Channel on 21 October 1916 by SMU-73 under the command of Gustav something i don't know what i don't know that um don't don't bother me with that Titanic decided to speed run his sink her sinking and only sank on 55 minutes this animation by the way is made by the titanic honor and glory people make sure to check the their youtube channel down in the description and yeah so i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next video